Do you see the love in the people who are struggling for the earth dance? The sooner we work together, the more we have a chance for the love that sets you free. Only love can set us free. Give us strength to live. Give us strength to work. For your education, for your food, for your people, for the nature of your place. Okay, I'm putting my my holes in for the potatoes at one foot intervals. I'm just going to move the straw out of the way and put the tomato in there. A uh, potato, pardon me. And uh, <coughs> that's all there is to it. I'll put some fertilizer on and uh, <coughs> some fungi, and I'm ready to go. Okay, we're we're looking here at the. Uh, potato bed and you can see I've kind of made little holes with the hoe every foot and three across and now I've got some chicky do uh, something like that and it's uh, organic uh, fertilizer and I'm gonna put it about two pounds per bed and I'm gonna spread it all through here some will go in the holes and some won't so that's it all right uh, these are the smaller potatoes and I'm going to just plant them whole. These I'm going to cut up into pieces and I want to make sure there's an eye in each piece. So I've got about 34, 35 in here uh, and I need 90 potatoes. So I'm hoping I can get all of that out of this bunch of stuff here. So um, that's pretty much it. I'm just going to be cutting these into uh, pieces and hoping to have an eye on each piece. All right, so, uh, okay, now I'm gonna plant some potatoes and I got mycorrhizal fungi inoculant here in the, uh, inoculum in the uh, bucket. I got my potato pieces. I'm gonna take and, uh, Throw some in the bottom of the hole, kind of dig it up, mix it around, put that potato down there, and then put a little dirt over top of it. I'm going to do that again here and get some, I put a handful of that stuff in there so that the roots, when they come out of here, will go through the fungi. So that's pretty much the process of how to do it. I want to get the, the fungi in first so that the, the roots go down through it. And then, of course, I'm going to put a lot of straw on top. Okay, you can see we're now where we've spread straw and we're going to spread some more. You can see down here, this is one of the hoses. I'm going to pull out the one that's leaking and uh, leave the other in. So that's it. Now we're going to wait for the sprouts to come through the straw.